Iran's top diplomat has called on the European Union to do more in its push to salvage the 2015 Iran nuclear deal, which has been left in limbo after President Trump pulled the U.S. out of it. Luaram reports. The main concern for Iran is how its economy will be affected by America's withdrawal from the 2015 nuclear deal. Washington has said it would reimpose sanctions on Iran, including ones aimed at the country's oil and financial sectors. EU leaders have pledged to try to keep Iran's oil trade and investment flowing, but noted that it would not be easy. However, Iran's foreign minister doesn't seem to be satisfied with their efforts, saying European political support for the accord was, quote, not sufficient. Mohammed Zavad Zarif made the comments on Sunday during a meeting with the EU's energy chief, Miguel Arias Canete, in Tehran. He added the possible withdrawal by major European companies from their cooperation with Iran is not consistent with the EU's commitment to implementing the nuclear deal. Several European firms suggested last week that their business in Iran would be restricted or end completely due to the reimposition of U.S. sanctions. Zarif went on to say the bloc should take more practical steps and increase its investments in Iran as well as preserve oil trade. Canetti responded by pledging to preserve the nuclear pact and continue cooperation between the EU and Iran. He added that the 2015 deal was working to curb Iran's nuclear weapons ambitions. U.S. Secretary of State Mike Pompeo, meanwhile, is scheduled to unveil the Trump administration's plan on a new deal with Iran on Monday, which may include a proposal for fresh talks. President Trump has long accused Tehran of not keeping its end of the current deal and that it should be expanded to include Iran's ballistic missile program. Iran has insisted there is nothing to renegotiate. Nuaram Arirang News.